Yo, Steve. Hey, what's going on, man? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, it's getting ready for bed here. Yeah, I'll play this week. Hey, you know me, man. I'm a baller. I'm game. Anyway, dude, yo, I'm really tired tonight, man. Seriously, bro, I'm like ready to crash like right now. Yeah, all right, later. Well, hey. Hey. So, buddy, how you doing? Good. Good. Well, that's wonderful. I'm just here with my baby. She gets a little cranky if I don't take her out every once in a while. I've learned to give her a little TLC, and now she and I get along a whole lot better. <laughs> eh, I wish I'd learned that same lesson with my ex-wife. Things would have been a whole lot easier on both of us. So, what's going on today? Oh, nothing. Just the usual. Well, that's okay, too. Huh? I mean, the usual usually does come around every now and then, right? Huh? Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sounds like you've got something on your mind, and you're not sure you want to talk about it. Is everything okay? Um, why do you ask? Why do I ask? Because it sounds like someone peed in your Cheerios. That's why. I think I may have screwed up, and I may have a little problem. And I think I, uh, I know it's not good. What do you mean? I think I may have made a bad choice yesterday. Did something happen when you were with me at church yesterday? No, 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 no. It happened after service. It. It happened at the service later on that day once once you and I had separated. Well, whatever, I mean, it's no big deal. Look, I didn't mean to bother you. And you know what? It's okay. I'll work it out. Well, maybe you can share a little of what's going on. No. I can do this on my own. Well... I don't know what happened, but I do know two things. One, everything will work out. And two, you have to meet me in the park in 30 minutes. 30 minutes? <laughs> I can't today. I have too many errands right now. My day's just too crazy today. I appreciate you wanting to meet with me and everything, but I'll get everything worked out. And you know what? You, me, lunch tomorrow, I'm buying. <laughs> well, that's wonderful. And the other thing that's wonderful is now I know three things. One, everything will work out. Two, you have to adjust your schedule today. And three, you have to meet me in the park in 29 minutes because I have the answer to your problem. Glad you could make it. Take a seat. <laughs> you know, you haven't told me what's going on and you don't have to. But I think you should at least tell the Lord about it. Look, I'm glad you started taking me to church and all. I mean, I've learned a lot so far. And I believe in God and Jesus and everything. But you've been going to the church for years and I've been there a month. See, God doesn't hear my prayers. You ever um, listen to a bunch of kids at a playground? I mean, to the average person, it's just a bunch of screaming and yelling. But to the parent, they can pick their child's voice out of the whole lot. And in a heartbeat. That's the way God is with your voice now. 
and he has a much bigger playground. I think God's a better listener than you think. Is what happened something you want to talk about? I mean, it's good to share it with a brother from another mother. I mean, it could be anything from swearing to stealing, lying, lust, drinking. I'm at that point yet. Yeah, but I know it'll help you. You don't have to tell me. You know, I've discovered things move forward a lot easier when they're properly aligned. And we got to get you moving, too. One of my favorite scriptures is 1 John 2.1. But if anyone does sin, we have an advocate with the Father. Jesus Christ, the righteous one. He himself is a propitiation for our sin, not only for ours, but for those of the whole world. I want you to tell our Heavenly Father what you couldn't tell me. But I told you, he doesn't hear my prayers. Uh, I think he'll get this one. Just tell him what's weighing you down so heavy. You weren't created to carry all these concerns you got going on in your mind. What am I supposed to write? You know, sometimes we make things harder than they really are. Just start out, dear God. Go ahead and write, I'll be back. What is that? Take your paper, fold it up. Trust me. Go ahead, release it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I didn't sign my name. I think you'll be okay. Right there. <laughs> oh Lord, I'm tired <laughs> okay. of right. this life I've been 